Hello everybody. All right, so now we are on lesson 12, level five, and we'll be looking at aligning content instead of items. So um, again, we have our help and tips if we need it. We have our cheat sheet right here that shows us the aligned content. Um, we have our show me how to get started if we need it. And so let's get into it. Here we go. Uh, you can use align content to set how multiple lines of items are spaced apart from each other. This property determines the spacing between lines and only has an effect when there is more than one line of content. Since this property only has an effect when you have more than one line of content, it should only be used when you have more than one line of content that is set to wrap. Make sure your preview window is resized so that there are two lines of content as the image shows. So let's do that. All right. Okay, well, yeah, let's see how this goes. Um, this property has six value options. Assign each one to make the page look like the image to the right. We can do that. Note the default appearance for all images before adding the align content property is to be stretched to fill the container. Okay. Add the align content property to each of the six div container rules in the style sheet. All right, so we have our containers already set up. Lovely. So let's go to the style sheet. <clears throat> so reading the comments, match the image on the right by applying the correct value with each of the aligned content properties. All right. Uh, we have our background color. We have all the, all this, you need this for each time we do it. So this should start to become standard when you're looking at code. Um, so here's our justify content. We learned about that two levels ago. And now here we are with our align content. So let's make this happen. Align content. And we have to figure out which one is going to make this happen. All right. <laughs> so we have flex start, flex end, center, space between, space around. I'm going to pull this down a little bit and stretch. You know, I'm kind of thinking that this is stretch, but you know, let's just look at some and, and figure it out. Let's see. So, okay. Well, it's not center. So that's good to know. Um, what's the next one? Flex start. Nope. Flex end. Nope. Uh, center. Nope. Space between, nope, uh, space around, nope, that leaves one left, so it's got to be stretch, I was right. Okay, so we got that one out of the way, now we're going to go look at two, and I think that two is going to be flex end, so let's try that and see, align content. Remember, I'm not looking at an answer key. I'm figuring this out right along with you. So flex and let's see, does that look accurate? It does, all right. So we got container two figured out. On to container three, all right. All right, we know we're gonna start with align content and now we gotta figure out which one. So I think this might be evenly. Oh space evenly that is um, but I made a mistake because that's not one of my options so let's try a space between does that do what I want it to do Ooh, no it does not all right so it's not space between let's try around there we go that's what we want all right, so third time's a charm, and on we move. Okay, is this one, so container four, I'm gonna guess that it is going to be center. Let's see if I'm right. And yes, that looks accurate, which leaves the yellow. I think yellow is going to be align content. I think this one's gonna be flex start. 
because this was flex end, this was space around, this was center, and that does seem to be the case. Okay, so now we have this one. Um, so we have container six. So this one's a little more interesting. Um, define how, okay, so add code below to define how wrapped items should be distributed vertically within the container. All right, so, okay, so this, okay, so, all right, this one, we have our align content, and I think this one's going to be space between because I believe that's the only one we haven't used yet. Let's see if I'm right. And I am. Fabulous. Okay. So we have our stretch, flex end, space around, center, flex start, and space between. All right. We've got our six. Uh, I think we've got this level done. All right. Let's move on to level six. See you over there.